There are so many terms today being thrown around with artificial intelligence and machine learning and LLMs that maybe a maybe just a quick guide, a quick brief guide to explaining what relates to what isn't a bad idea. Hi, my name is Jack Heslin with the AI Conversation. And very briefly today, we're just going to take you through what, what is the relationship between an artificial intelligence, a machine learning, a deep learning, an LLM? And then we're going to get to why you as a CEO, a president, a business owner, don't really need to know this. But we'll take you through it briefly. So starting at the top, AI, artificial intelligence, it's really an umbrella term. There are many types of AI underneath it or fit within it. But it, it is used in basic robot programming. You use it in search algorithms. There are Boolean logic applications to it and many, many other applications where AI, you could say, is at a, a simpler level of artificial intelligence. Now, there's lots of it you can do before you have to get any deeper with AI, but as applications get more complicated, then you might get to machine learning, which is a subset of artificial intelligence. So for example, anomaly detection and fraud prevention. This is huge in finance. Um, a credit card company looks at millions of transactions and says, wait a minute, here's something that's kind of out of pattern. What's going on there? And it could be in an aggregate scale or it could be to your personal spending. But they're looking for, they're looking for things that are out of pattern. And predictive analytics and forecasting is also a very huge machine learning application within the subset of AI. There are many machine learning applications. These are just a couple of examples. But if you need to go deeper, then within machine learning, you have deep learning. This is where you get into um, complex uh, algorithms about image recognition. Is this a dog? Is this a cat? Is this something out of pattern in this particular um, visual representation of, a, of an environment here? And of course, speech to text and where it can really play a big role is in identifying molecular structures and drug research that can enormously speed up the amount of time it takes to bring a new drug to market. And then finally, after you've gone from AI to ML to DL, that's where, and this has become a very common term now in uh, mainstream media when writing about artificial intelligence, you get to large language models. They are trained on enormous data sets, billions of bits of data, billions of parameters. Um, and that's where you get to chat GPT and BERT and other really high-end AI models. They are AI platforms, but specifically they're LLMs, large language models. So this is one representation. Doesn't have to be the only, but if AI, and then with AI you have ML, with ML you have DL, and within DL you have your LLMs. Now. You're a company CEO, you're a company president, you're a business owner. What is it you need to know about these? You don't. You don't need to know the distinction from one to another. The decision making process here is the same as if you're looking at buying a new piece of software or if you have a fleet of trucks, do you need a new truck? You need to think about the problems in your business you want to solve. Is there a problem in finance or sales or HR or some other area? And then after you thought about those problems, if you think an AI-based solution might be, a, might be an appropriate path, you need to have a conversation about, well, what data do we need? Do we have historical data to solve this problem? Does the historical data have any gaps? In other words, how complete is that data? If, 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 if you don't have the data, or if you have data but it's not complete, an AI solution isn't going to solve your problem. Now. If looking at all this, you're not sure where to start, or you just think it's helpful to talk to someone, well, that's where we come in. Talk to the AI Conversation. Go to our website, www.theaiconversation.com. Click on any link, and you can see you can schedule the time to talk. Let's talk about the problem you're having. Let's talk about what it is you want to solve. And really important, what would your company look like if you solve this problem? What What's the big benefit? That we, we, Are you freeing up people's time? Is it more revenue? Is it lower costs? Is it an opportunity to get into a new market? Let's talk about those things and then talk about the data you have, how complete is the data, and 
is there an AI solution that would address that problem? Okay, my name's Jack Heslin, the AI Conversation. Hope, uh, hope you found that interesting and look forward to talking with you. Bye-bye.